Boys, how you been? Hope you're staying safe, relentless, but uh, man, you're in store for one today. Oh my goodness, you're gonna love it. We got uh, got all this shit on the table, we could clean that up quick. Got a couple sheets of the metals under here, that's kind of just where I keep them, because it's just, you know, easier that way. You slide it off, cut the chunk off you need, away you go, but, Got a couple things, fucking spray paint cans. We'll put some shit away and this and that. And I got a, got some dicks gonna deliver some uh, some of the more of the metals. I got a, we wanted to do a screen door in the front for a minute, eh? And just never got around to them by the time you fucking this and that. This little bucket, right? But this is the time of the year because when it's hot as fuck out, the doors are shut and the air conditioner's on. But like right now, it'd be nice to have the breeze coming through with the nice cool factor, right? So. Yeah, the old lady uh, put in the request there, so we'll see what we can come up with. But, uh, oh, Dickie, he's loving life. He is loving life out there. Terrible. He's uh, he's come up with a couple excuses so far, but uh, nothing too drastic. Just forgot to plug in the drill and it wouldn't work. Hey, eh? Fucking poor bastard. But she's coming along. Got a couple. I don't know how good you can see it, but he's couple patches inward and along there and I mean we still gotta cut out some shit and patch these the tops of these ones and stuff and whatever pick up a couple of our numps we went through quite a few uh quite a few steps how you making out buddy pretty good you love you life you what hammer. you got a what chisel and hammer chisel and hammer yeah do you love life no you don't you no. hate life yeah it wouldn't no good yeah Fuck. Yeah. Well, ain't no good, but life no good. Oh, I apologize. <laughs> oh, poor Richard. Son of a... Oh, yeah, we're going to call you D-Bag now. Right. Hey, D-Bag and T-Bag. His brother okay. T-Bag. He D-Bag. Hey. Fucking... Dick bag, yeah, dick bag needs, a, needs a chisel. Hey. For sakes. Get rid of that. Oh, kicking that every single time I walk by it. Hey. Look at that one. Take that into the Doniker with you. Eh? I can take that into the Doniker with you, bud. Oh, Paul F. That's my good one. My blue hammer. Uh oh. What'd you find? What'd you do with it? Oh no. That'd be terrible. That'd be terrible, but yeah, I gotta clean up some shit because I got some metal getting delivered. And, uh,. Yeah, hopefully. Fuck. Here, I got an idea, buddy. We got to get rid of some of this shit. These pails of uh, Absorbol, they're, uh, they're for the van or whatever. So when you're fucking spilling shit relentless, we got some, some stuff to absorb it yeah. and stuff. But it's for like absorbing and then scooping up, not just yeah. leaving on the ground and getting rained on and being dick, right? And what else? Fuck. We gotta put this in the shipping container that's got the vehicles and the plow blade and shit in front of it, and as well as this. Okay. Or, yeah, there should be room, you know, because there's the engine hoist in there, right? Yeah. I don't Anything know. to not grind and chisel, eh? Oh, I fuck. Hey. Eh? I don't mind it. I apologize. Keep me busy. Now, something to do in the, so you don't get the corona, eh? You want to end up going on a gallivant to the motel and catching the corona for frig sakes. Me and the woman are no longer together. You just quit? Yeah. She quit, quit. Quit that nonsense? Yeah, she quit. She said, it's my fault. Okay, then we'll go here. Yeah. I said, okay. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. eh? Oh, well. There'll be, a, there'll be an Inwood bride sooner or later, hey? Maybe. Somebody will smell that hammer and come a-running. Oh. Oh. Oh, hey, I apologize. I just had a little, little something kind of work its way up my neck hole there a little bit. <laughs> but, uh, any words, boys? Oh, the old trim skis off the 83, too. Those are highly sought after commodities. Like, I fucking, that's how dumb I am, right? Like, I have a hard time throwing this shit out, but, like, I wanted to keep them as, like, a template to mark it on, like, the sheet of the aluminum and just make my own sort of thing, but yeah, I'm not even gonna put carpet in the truck or anything, and I'd rather not drill holes in the floor, so I can just pretty well frig right off. But when we put the door trim on there and shit, that's probably what we're gonna do, but 
we uh you know, we're start, we don't need that we need some measure tape cut our own pieces cut our own pieces look at dicky go eh good lord bet she wishes he was back in the car and he now told me the other day he says they called me to see if I was coming back for the season. I said, nope, I got a pretty good gig going on here right now. Felt a little tingle in my downstairs. Thought, I thought for a minute the next thing he was gonna say was you wanna come out to the Doniker with me, but no, not yet. Not very, I'm a little bit, you know, I'm a, I'm a feeler, you know what I mean? Feeler, but whatever. <coughs> whatever, got my, Hell, under curtain. Good lord. I ordered a thing of like a fucking pile of these. I don't have to find them or something, I guess. Fuck's sakes. This is fucking plugged in too. Like, I don't want to pull the trigger, but fuck's sakes. Always work on your drill with it plugged the fuck in big time, especially when you're working on the brushes. That's the best time. See? I freaking pull you, man. problem with having so much shit everywhere it's like oh I know where my brushes are I open the drawer oh I got like a pack of like 50 of them for this drill that wouldn't fit in that drawer so I've obviously put them somewhere else but you know and at the time when you're putting it somewhere you're like you're like oh yeah I'll put these here and I'll totally remember next time it needs fucking the snap but yeah it's like all the places that I have that I usually do the old fucking dump ski of the shit I, I know fine I, I know fine so Whatever, I think we don't got enough to do. Just figured, you know, while we were here. Got it spinning for now anyway.
But uh, yeah, this fucking Coromus is looking like uh, it's gonna be the excuse of why I can't build the shop this year. Right, so that's pretty cool. So I just, I just gotta clear shit out. I just gotta like take everything that I'm not, that's not like tools that I'm fucking using or this, that, and the other thing, and just shh, out ski. But I mean, really, you know, got a table saw and chop saw and stuff. Fuck, if you need to like cut a piece of wood to make a shelf for this and that, it'd be nice to just be at all oh, waltz over to it, zing, cut a piece. You know what I mean? Things would happen a lot. Uh, you know, as I come out here and I look at it and I'm like, oh fuck, I gotta move this, I gotta move that, I gotta move this, I gotta drag the fucking thing out here, I gotta make enough room around the thing to friggin' work on it, right? No go, quit, right? Got hard, in with customs, you know what it is. But I ordered some metals today, was hoping it was gonna come today. No, no. We'll have to get the fucking plasma cutter out here too. And zip some chunks off this thing. There's no need for the tie downs and fucking all this extra weight and stuff. I want to get, a, get it as light as possible and then weigh the whole unit and then get a fucking uh, yellow sticker in accordance to the weight of my fucking situation, right? So I'm not going to be towing cars with it. It's just going to be towing it empty to a parking lot and putting people's rigs up on it, dealerships, fucking businesses, whatever, right? 54. Just have an area where the fucking welders were all plugged in. You know, that's a big deal, but fuck, man. Just gonna set the camera up quick so we can catch ourselves just fucking absolutely struggling and dying like fuckers. Well, he's gonna just try to grab it himself.
good fucking lord. Just an idiot. Eh? Just a fucking idiot. Oh, goodness gracious. I don't know how I do it, boys. Deserve to get a certificate for just dealing with myself, eh? I do. But uh, yeah, that's that's her for today, boys. Quit. Got a couple patches. Got a piece cut. Ordered some steel. You know, I was gonna do more, but uh, yeah. But anyways, boys. Priest Troy Valve on the Patreon mix friggin'. There's some more grease over there if you uh, care to partake. And yeah, what's this? Like part uh, 75. You guys love these movies. This is like part 75 of. Uh, Phipson trailer, eh? Cheapest trailer on marketplace, it is. It was. But uh anyways boys. Don't let the watchers get you.